Hey guys, Jonathan here, and I'm here with Andrew Garfield. Okay, not the real Andrew Garfield, but the 2013 San Diego Comic-Con exclusive minifigure, which is one of the rarest LEGO minifigures ever, let alone the most valuable LEGO Marvel figure ever. In fact, if you're curious, as of this video, he's valued at about $18,000, which is crazy. I didn't pay anywhere near that amount. In fact, I paid less than $10,000 for mine, but it is a very cool piece to own, and actually, today's video is sort of about it. So, it's not about this figure in particular, but as a quick little recap, if you didn't know, you had to be an attendee at the 2013 San Diego Comic Con to even have a chance to win this, and even if you did win it, you had to win a raffle and there were only 350 winners selected. Well, like I said, there was a raffle, and in order to enter that raffle, you needed a raffle ticket. Yes, guys, this is a very rare 2013 San Diego Comic-Con raffle ticket for the Amazing Spider-Man, as you can see here. So you would have needed to obtain one of these tickets from Comic-Con about 11 years ago just to have a chance to win the Andrew Garfield Amazing Spider-Man minifigure. So it is truly a very, very rare piece of LEGO history to have both pieces together, and it's a true honor to be able to do that. Now, I just paid $230 for just the ticket on eBay, and that's a lot of money for just literally a piece of paper with ink printed on it, but when you look at it in the full context of being able to put these two together and finally complete the set, I am one of the very, very, very few people on planet Earth to own both of these together, and I'm super grateful to be able to do that. So. Thanks for clicking on today's video, guys. If you want to see the full review of the Andrew Garfield figure, I've got that video on the channel. It's definitely a cool walk down memory lane and something very few people will get to see. And I'm grateful to be able to share that with you guys. And of course, it's time for Andrew Garfield to go back to the bank vault. I don't even keep this in my house, guys. I have a safety deposit box at the bank where I store this and I keep it there just for safety because... It's become so valuable, I feel weird even having it in my house. So now the ticket can go in the bank vault and keep him company there. Anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Be sure to hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video.